Rafael Nadal's coach had COVID symptoms so severe he nearly went to hospital. Carlos Moya has opened up on his COVID symptoms after testing positive shortly after Rafael Nadal returned a positive test following the Mubadala World Tennis Championship. Nadal recently announced he had tested positive when returning home to Spain after the Mubadala World Tennis Championship. Nadal's coach and former world number one Carlos Moya has also tested positive, and has since revealed that his symptoms were so bad he almost needed hospital treatment. The 1998 French Open champion said he had tested negative in a lateral flow but got a PCR once a positive test can been confirmed in the Nadal camp, and also tested positive. Moya then opened up on his experience with the virus, saying, I am vaccinated with two doses and the symptoms have been quite strong in the last 24 hours, although without having to go to the hospital, now much better, I hope the worst is over. Fever, headache, sweating, pain all over the body, chills have been my symptoms, I'm sure the vaccine has helped to not get worse or have to visit the hospital. Nadal himself said he had been having some unpleasant moments but hoped to improve little by little. The 13-time Grand Slam champion also admitted he had to have total flexibility with my calendar and I will analyse my options depending on my progress, with Covid. It throws his Australian Open chances into doubt, but on Wednesday the tournament director admitted Nadal would be fine in time to compete. The players who are testing positive now, Rafa from last Saturday, they will complete a time when they become no longer infectious, when they're shedding the virus and they will be fine, tournament director and Tennis Australia boss Craig Tiley said. Probably if you're getting positive, now, is a good thing, never getting positive is a good thing, but if it's going to be a situation where you want to play the Australian Open, your timing, to get the virus, would be now. Mm-hmm.